Huh. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Dragon's Den. I am Azeroth, and this is Bendy and the Ink Machine. Uh, I am re-recording this because I done goofed. I uh, didn't have the picture, the frame set up properly, so um, yeah, big old blank spot. <sighs> anyway, let's get back into it. Uh, I'm gonna see. No, I can't do that now. Uh, fuck it. I was gonna see if I could plug in a controller, but I'd have to unplug my mouse or unplug my microphone, and uh, yeah, I don't want to do either of that. Alright, Joey. I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Alright. Find the ink machine. You're a little laggy despite the high frames. What the hell? Alright, here's good old inky. So this is good old Bendy here, you know. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Bendy and the Ink Machine, and if you don't know by now, I'm actually a little surprised, uh, Bendy and the Ink Machine is an action-adventure action game. Uh, the first chapter, not much uh, not much action, just mostly the adventure part, uh, but it's set up in, in different tiers. Um, I have a friend who wants me to play this. I don't really understand why. I mean, great game, but, hmm. Action adventure games are never very good at jump scares. So we need to collect these objects to get the ink machine working. Um, I do love the aesthetic for this. It's both, I don't even know how to describe it, but it seems both not real and very real at the same time. The Dancing Demon. Well, that's not a very nice name. Well, he is a demon. But he's a good demon. Hm. And where did you come from? Mm. Put this here. Oh my god. Joey, what were you doing? The illusion of the living. Who's laughing now? You know, sometimes when they make games like this, they sometimes have to add in some chest ripping. Um, I believe later on this might be a little... It might have a bit of shooting, like in Doom or in uh, uh, Quake. Uh, judging from the looks of that, it's probably going to have some of that. So, yeah, there's going to be a little bit of uh, hardcore action going on, but we should be fine for now. I can't control this thing very well. No. Oh, is that my attempt at sprinting? Yeah. Well, I know one of the pieces we need is right over here. Uh, beyond that, I actually kind of forget where everything is because it's been a little bit since I did it because I've been putting off re-recording this. Come on, pick it up. There we go. Hmm, maybe I'm supposed to get something to go through that. Yeah, so there's not really much going on, so we'll try to come back... Uh, once I get all the stuff, I'll show you where they are, but... Right now, there's really nothing. Let's just go around and collect some stuff. Hey, Bendy. Shouldn't have walked away from that, but we've got stuff to do. Uh, actually, something I'm noticing. When I first played this, there was bacon soup everywhere. Uh, now there's none. Except for, I guess, the ones I missed. Come on, let me drink it. What 
that's that, that's not bad. Um, I don't mind getting all the other stuff. I believe in the first chapter they're considered collectibles anyway, so get them all. Don't miss any. Ooh, what's that up there? Is it up there? Oh well. Well, there's the wrench I need. It's a bendy doll. Ah, he's adorable. Ah, I just want to pinch his cheeks and punch him in the face. But I like punching things in the face, so that doesn't say much, does it? Cute face. No. Yeah, right here. Ha ha. Ha ha Ink should not have toxic signs on it. Okay, what's through here, though? Oh, it just loops me back around. The pressure is low. Yes, must do the thing. I remember where that switch was, because I was just there. Oh god damn it, stop spinning me around. Nope, ink pressure's down this way. I must follow the bendy. You fuck right off now. <sighs> Ew. It's splooging all over the place. Why is it being so laggy? I have everything closed that's supposed to be closed. I will admit the sound of the pipes getting ink flowing through them is a little creepy. Weird color change. A shift in the tonal color. Huh. Okay. That surprisingly made me a little twitchy. But I knew it was coming, so no big deal. I gotta get at it now. Oh, Bendy, you and your silly antics. Don't blame you. He's a bit of a dick. Doesn't even pay his people well, apparently. Otherwise, the place never would have got closed down. Oh, we got more ink. Clear up to the knees. Uh, I think this might actually be up to the waist. And we are just a swimming in it. 
Oh yeah, this one's nice and deep. I think it's telling me something. This will definitely come in handy. Oh, those are holding ink. <laughs> also, the creator lied to us, apparently. I wonder what that means. Also, this guy is damn strong to be able to cut through a piece of wood like that with a single strike. Granted, not good enough to cut through two, but you know, damn good. Oh, hey, Bendy. Oh, I got knocked out. Well, that's the end of the first chapter. I don't have the other chapters yet. I'm going to be working on that later. Uh, if you guys do want to see more and you actually want to help support this, uh, please donate to my Patreon. I've got a few tiers. Um, nothing too crazy, but... Depending on what I can get, I can do more advertising, buy more games, and get more content out for you guys faster, and even start hiring people to start helping me out, i.e. an editor, because I don't do editing very well. Anyway, we're going to get through these uh, credits here, and I guess it just skipped by itself. I didn't hit anything. What the fuck? Anyway, thank you guys for tuning in. If you like this video, please click like and subscribe. Click the video in the top right for videos that YouTube thinks you will like. And click the video in the bottom right for the latest videos I've done. Click that notification button so that way you guys know when I upload. And as always, I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.